Oh, hello. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from Williams Sandwich Recipes of 1974, we're going to make the cheese and onion bake sandwich. We kick things off by putting a piece of bread in a 9x9 nine nine baking dish and topping with chopped onions. We top that with a slice of American cheese. Top that with another slice of bread and another slice of American cheese. Oh, but we're not done. That's because now we beat an egg into some milk. Now we add in salt and dry mustard. Now we pour a quarter of our mixture over top. Then into a 350 degree oven for 35 minutes. I gotta say this preparation method was a little bit questionable. Um, the bottom slice of bread soaked up all the liquid and became much bigger than the top slice. And it's kind of gooey, it's not fully set, uh, whereas the top is. All right, whatever. Let's give this cheese and onion bake sandwich a go. It's not bad, nice eggy uh, custard. Uh, the American cheese is just fine and the onions there, it's, it's fine, it's fine. Um, I do want to plus it up. First, I'm gonna add some Nuke's Grillo's Pickles hot sauce. It's a hot sauce that basically tastes like Grillo's pickles. Next, I'm gonna add some Brett's aioli flavored potato chips that I reviewed over on In the Chips Ferry. You can check out that review on YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. Okay, let's give this cheese and onion bake sandwich plussed up with the Grillo's Pickles hot sauce from Nukes and the uh, aioli, which is basically garlic, uh, flavored potato chips from Brett's. The Brett's uh, potato chips are aioli flavored, which is basically like a garlic mayonnaise type thing. To me, they only tasted of garlic, which is great. They're bringing a crunch here, they're bringing the garlic, and the Nukes is bringing a little heat and a pickly pop from the Grillo's Pickles. That is now tasty. Okay, so the original cheese and onion bake sandwich, it was fine tasting. I'm gonna give it a middle of the road uh, rating. I think I'm gonna go five on that one. Didn't blow my mind, but it wasn't bad. Plussed up with the Brett's aioli flavored potato chips, basically garlic, and the Nukes Grillo's Pickles hot sauce. That's like a seven and a half now. That is a very delicious flavor combination. I am definitely gonna finish that. I don't know that I would make this again, but I'm definitely gonna finish that plussed up version. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow. Flavored potato chips from Brett's. Oops.